Here's an advanced method of Ho'oponopono that will help you bring love and healing and connection to people in your life. Hi everyone, Robert Zink, your Miracle Mentor and Alchemy Success Coach. And today we are soaring high like a big, beautiful eagle. And we're always flying in the direction of your dreams and your goals. I want to thank you for subscribing and remember to click the bell icon because we're here almost every day with a new empowering video to help you on your journey. Well, ever since I came across the book Zero Limits by Dr. Joe Vitale and Dr. Hugh Lin, I have been in love with Ho'oponopono and I've used it personally in my own journey for years to bring about healing in people's lives and to bring about healing in our relationship. And I'm going to share something with you that is very personal to me, but I want to share this with you. I began developing shamanic tapping and release. And this is a system that is based on EFT, but it's more of a shamanic ritualistic way of approaching it. I began to combine that with Ho'oponopono and wow, all of a sudden I didn't just feel better after doing Ho'oponopono. I noticed that the other people that I was doing it for began to act different. They began to treat me differently. They began to feel different. It seemed to bring about a form of healing in their life. Now, look, at, I'm not saying that the method I'm going to share with you is better. All I'm going to say is that for me, in my journey, it works and it works extremely fast. If you've been in a relationship, if you have a specific person, if you've gone through a divorce and you want to rebuild a connection and bring about healing, this is perfect. If you know someone in your life that is going through a difficult time, who is struggling, who is fighting with themselves on the inside, this is perfect. This method that I'm about to share with you is a little bit more ritualistic. So I'm going to urge you, if you want to do this, do it every day with the video and I'll put the timestamp where it begins so that you don't have to go through this opening again. So what you're going to want to do first is visualize the person that you are sending this healing energy to. You can visualize them. You can have a picture of them. I like to have a picture, but in this case, I'm simply going to visualize and you close your eyes and from your interior spirit outward, you simply say these three words, I love you. I love you. I love you. And now begin to raise energy, visualize the white light above your head, the infinite light of the universe. Breathe it in and create a ball of light, a ball of love. Feel it in your hands. and say into the ball, I love you. And now raising the ball above your head, bring it down and send it outward to the image of the person you wish to receive it. Notice both of my hands are pointed out. And then I bring my left forefinger back to my lips. 
this seals the energy so that it doesn't come back to me, so that it stays with the person that I sent it to. The next phrase is a little bit different. It's not simply, I'm sorry. It's, I'm sorry for your pain. I'm sorry for your pain. I'm sorry for your pain. And now visualize the white light above your head. Begin to create that chi ball of energy. Feel it in between your hands. After a while, you won't even need to use your imagination. You'll just feel the energy. Create it into a beautiful ball and say into the ball, I'm sorry for your pain. Now raise it above your head. Bring it down and send it to the recipient. And then left forefinger to the lips and seal the energy. The next phrase normally is please forgive me. But I found that this phrase seems to be more effective, at least in the kind of people that I'm bringing healing to. Let us forgive each other. Let us forgive each other. Let us forgive each other. White light above the head, the infinite light of the universe, the healing light of the universe. Bring it down, breathe it down into your hands, feel that energy, create that ball of light. Let us forgive each other. Send it out to the recipient. And then again, seal the energy. And then finally you say, thank you. And that's all there is. Thank you. Thank you. Rub your hands together. And this one is going to be a little bit different. You create that ball of energy. And you say into it, thank you. And now you say, I send you light and healing. send it to the recipient. Seal the energy. Hi Flyers, it's very important that you see the recipient receiving that beautiful healing, that light in healing. See them when you say the words, I love you. See them receiving it when you say the words, I'm sorry for your pain. 
see and feel them receiving it when you say, let us forgive each other. And especially at the end, when you say, thank you, I send you light and healing. Now, find someone to heal. There's no shortage. Here's some other videos to help you on your journey.